Ooh, I should keep Viper, should I not? Right, we're gonna keep this in case that they have the weapon again. I will say that the Paladin matchup is kind of unfortunate because unfortunate because the sorceresses are like so powerful when they go off, but against Paladin, there's like only two spells basically. Unless you're playing against Holy Paladin, so it feels a little bad. I don't know if I want to drop the Doomsayer yet. Initializing descent. Uh, yes. I'll have to wait until after the game is done, though, because I got to go into the client to get the deck code because the deck tracker is not currently working. So hang tight and don't let me forget, and then I can definitely uh, get it for you. All right, I think we can drop this now. It kind of sucks we don't have anything do next turn though of course when i keep the viper they don't have the weapon is it not just like ping and play mistress though Side effect. Yeah. Trust me. just like it's harder for the doomsayer to clear like the, the longer you wait but it's not like they have a lot of burst from hand though so if they only put like four power on the board or something then we should be okay See what I mean? See what I mean? If we had just dropped the Doomsayer that turn, then we wouldn't. But the... Whatever shall I do? I mean, at least they have to run into it. I guess I could Viper swap, and I probably at this point I feel like the thing isn't coming down for a little while. So I suppose we could do this. Paladin seems tough. At this point, we need to save this combo, right? Oh, so One more turn and then we can do it. Might have been worth just dropping the Viper. Okay, if we can just survive into the Barden Freeze, that'd be great. This might sting. At least we can take this damage off the board. Uh, they won't be able to Leviathan and clear the thing, right? Because it'll be six. And they've already used coin, so I don't see how they would clear a Doomsayer. Yeah, it's a great song. Classic. By my calculations, you need to chill out. Actually, Leviathan, there's only a spot of room for one. <gasps> I thought I was gonna be able to clear it. Six attack. Okay. <laughs> All right. All right, well, we have to Belinda, I think. We have to get some spells to the hand that we're able to ca cast. Hopefully it'll be Blizzard and then we can get another parrot out of it. Hmm. A little scary. We're at 12, but hopefully a Blizzard. Okay, there's one. Okay. Good evening, dragon folk. How be your hordes? No! I hate, like, not casting the sorceress when I can't... You want to get value from the this, but it's fine. At least we'll be able to... Blizzard. That's nice for some health. We could ping Blizzard. Is there anything else besides that that we could do? Not really. In full clear, which is pretty dupe. They will have Smite. I guess, God, that feels so bad. Just Six damage into a 1-1, one, one. no thanks. This is kind of cool. Now we have a uh, way to gain armor, but... So the parrot uh, has a blizzard in it, which is nice. So we obviously need to do that again, do we not? We can't also Curious. play the evoker, sadly. We have to ping the one, two, and then I guess kill a six, four, or maybe this. All right, kill this thing. 
Next turn we could cast Rune and the Lady, which might be our best best play. And we just monk a prey that the Rune is like a god Rune at clearing this. Please. There is also a chance that we there's two runes, both amulets are in the deck, so we can't like guarantee the second blizzard on this, unfortunately. All right, pray. Rune first. Yes. Please, please game. We're off to a great start. We're off to a great start. Okay, just a little bit more. Just okay. 5-1. God damn it. The 5-1, the please. Thank you. So good. Now the question is, is do we want to never worry? Do we want to go for this or go here and here? That's really tough. I kind of want to just guarantee get this out of the way, gain this armor. But it might actually just be these two. I can do, you know, I'm just going to do this because we can combo more. Like if I wanted to do this and this. However, I get the information of what I get next turn, though. It's the only thing. Like, maybe I really want to cast Amulet. Now I can't ask, cast Amulet. Allie, it's the wrong deck code. I'm aware. I'm aware. I can only grab the deck code from the client, so we need to wait until this game is done. Because my uh, deck tracker is not working, so there's no way for me to get the code right now. Observe. Analyze. Engage. So this is a rune. Not sure if we want to risk it. We just want to grab the get, gain some health. I also really wouldn't mind mutinessing. And like I could trade here. I could ping. Because I could freeze face. Hold on. We could go here, here, ping, freeze, mutinous, play this. Or do we like double deep water? All right. No I honestly think at this ship. point we're in such a good position that we can probably. No ways can sink this ship. Not freak out. Only so much time. Double deep. What is this? Wub, wub to fuck? The answer to the Le Le Leviathan, I think. So, lady, how impactful was she this time around? Yeah. Oh, that, there's another Leviathan. Second one. Need to get something chonky down. Sucks that if we want a blizzard, we can't really develop anything else. Would have, you know, perhaps it was the mutinous. Like, if we had gotten the Leviathan, it would have been nice. That's cheating. I agree. I mean, we could blizzard doom, try to go for an empty board to develop the, uh... No. We need to sage blizzard, we can do that. What's the mini set? Uh, how many total cards? Is it 35? Is it always 35? It's when they release a set of cards in between expansions to kind of keep things a little bit more interesting. Because oftentimes it gets a bit boring, like between the, the months. It's 35, right? Yeah. Uh, each class gets three new cards amongst some uh, neutrals. And yeah, it keeps the game fresh in between the expansions. You can buy it for 2,000 gold uh, in the shop right now. Oh my god, regret! Wow, okay, I'm bad. We should have cleared it. It's it's fine. It's I honestly don't think it'll cost us the whole freaky game, but I'm still upset about it. Should have cleared it. It's my bad. I forgot about any. We could Bran Blizzard with the Parrot. Does that do anything? Does that feel cool? Do we like that play? Or do we just like free like Blizzarding and Doomsayer? I mean, they're, how on earth would they answer a Doomsayer? I mean, Bran, we get to like keep our board alive. But hmm. Mothership? Ooh, they could. They could Mothership. 
can't remember if they've played one already. Who knows what secrets will played one. So I clear this. I don't really know why I'm keeping the other one alive, honestly. For this. It's not like they have weapons, really, that attack face. But now, and it's not like there's another any, so we probably could have just left it alive, but. Fine. We have to mutinous now. Oh. I mean, that's nice. However, is this the opportunity to, like, Drake? No, it's probably just mutinous, but what if we get something super shit? <laughs> Face or pop one? I can answer. Probably pop one. So much time. Right? Yeah, honestly, I, I, I might have jinxed myself. Not killing the Leviathan might have literally cost me the game. Because there's so much value that came from being able to copy it. <gasps> okay, we're at 27. Oh my god! Okay. Box time? I guess it's box time. Is it box time? Or is it like, we're not dead, are we? This is 14, 20. What if box sucks? How dare you. It's gotta be box, right? Where the hell is the Calicos? Okay, don't suck. Please, 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 please. Kill the seven five? Okay, I guess, let's start. Boop, okay. Good order, good job, good job. Almost perfect. All right. What's what top deck? Now we need to like put shit down so if they get smite, that's probably smite. It's definitely smite. It's not smite. I think we can do this at this point, right? Out of cards. Need to kill them. I'm getting stressed. Looks nice. Obviously, they go face. I'm at 17, though. This does how much? Four damage randomly. Okay, so I can just lay a couple taunts down. I mean, that should be moderately annoying, correct? Curious. I can even throw the Doomsayer down. All right, I'm just going to play this before I decide against the correct play. So we're going to put that down. Now, I could just kill the 8-4 and put a Doomsayer down, and then I don't see... But then I have a follow-up taunt, though. Like, I kind of just want to ignite the 8-4 and see what happens. Only so much time. They're so close to dying, though. It feels so bad. I don't know. If anything, I should still ignite, actually. Why would I not ignite? And they're out of cards. It's fine. We've won. Bottom right, but buddy. Oh, God. <laughs> oh, it's fine. It's fine. Another smite? Actually, another smite would be kind of irritating. They trade and then kill the Doomsayer. I have to put another taunt down. Second smite. Please, no. Stop messing with me, dude. <laughs> Got a job for me? Oh, that thing's got... Oh, yeah, of course. Oh! Oh! I totally forgot about the charge aspect of everything. Okay. This is... This is scary. <laughs> um, We have to put another taunt down. I'm gonna guess kill the 8-4. School teacher? No. I mean, we literally just go here. We ignite. Probably have to trade... Like we have to trade afterward, that sucks. Curious. I might have to Zola the taunt. I bring the muscle and 
Like, am I supposed to do this and then kill the 8-4 so that I just keep putting taunts down until I find things that I need? Like, eventually I'm gonna get... Like, I can answer the thing now. I just have to go... I can use the ignite to kill. Yeah, I think that definitely was actually correct. Right, like if you just lay, if you just get another taunt, then you don't lose. Like you just don't lose. All right, I feel like we should take bets on if it's actually sh like the class or rogue. This is probably another Murloc Shaman. I'm feeling it. All right, we like this. We like this. I honestly kind of like this too, but I feel like I like this better when I have a Doomsayer in my hand. If it is Shaman, uh, Murloc Shaman, these things are actually feeling a little bad in the meta. I'm not gonna lie, but I'm not gonna play the deck without it. But if your opposing class does not have a lot of spells, they don't feel super great. <laughs> I guess they're still taunts. I usually use lotion SPF, but I recently bought a spray SPF. Do you guys know how I should apply it to my face? Um, yeah, the spray sunscreen is a bit weird when... I, I would probably recommend buying a separate... Like, you have spray and then lotion for the face. Honestly, the spray is way more. Oh wow, are we supposed to go coin into coin? Ah, uh, but maybe. Like we're expensive deck though. I like it. Let's do it. It's just something to do with the new card. Let's go. Spray it in your hand first. Yeah, I mean you can do this, but it's a bit. It depends on the spray. Okay, it depends on the kind of spray sunscreen because some of them are like very sheer and clear, and I feel like it just doesn't do the job. But then there are other sprays that are like more on the like white, like creamier side of things. Are the tough that weird? But you know what I mean. Uh, thick, yeah, thick, <laughs> white and creamy. Okay. Oh my god. But you know what I'm saying. For the record, I think it probably was correct just to play this into three and then have expensive. But like the fact that we had a four too. Anyway, I have firsthand experience with this because I, when I went to Vegas, I actually bought spray sunscreen. Okay, that is like the whitest sunscreen in the world. Like you know how sometimes you apply sunscreen, and I'm already like ridiculously white. So if I don't have like the clear sheer kind, it makes me look even paler. And then I was like, never again am I buying this, like, super white sunscreen. Anyway, so, <laughs> it's like, we can beetle ping. Is that better than this? Maybe. Curious. Not even like we could play Blizzard next turn. So yeah, let's uh, kill the Murloc. But make sure you're buying, like, reef safe stuff. I actually think that, like, spray is generally air soul things are worse for the environment so it's probably better to do lotion but i'm not gonna judge you but it, at the very least make sure it's like reef safe reef safe sunscreen yeah i have to rock like spf 75 over here just kidding i can probably get away with like 30 or 50 but man i get sunburned so All right, so I could trade this away, try and get a better like 10, but I honestly think I, all I really want is Blizzard, so I don't really want to put this in the pool. I think I'm just gonna try and get Blizzard here. I can swap it afterwards. Nice. I did go to Costa Rica. I actually have been thinking about my Costa Rica trip a lot because uh, it was basically this time last year. And look, I'm wearing, or I'm using my Costa Rica mug today. Um, why did I just take a sip of like three hour old coffee? I don't know, but I did. Um, I did not really go out in the sun all that much when I was in Costa Rica. <laughs> it was a dental holiday, so I, I got, got my teeth done. I suppose I, yeah, yeah, I wasn't, Value trade. Sure. Actually, that's not even a Murloc. Don't let me forget about this play. I always forget about this one. Bran into Varden. Deals four damage to everything. 
Shout out to Zotan. Yes, thank you, Skydevs. Hi, everybody. My name is Allie. We are playing Mage Shocker, my favorite class. Uh, we're trying out the new lady... Forget her name. The lady, the five mana, five, five card, as well as the Snapdragon in this big spell mage battle cry deck. Yes, I know it sounds sus, but I promise we have been winning some games. Uh, thank you for sharing your community with me, though. I appreciate it. And yeah, stick around. And you want to compete if you're a European server player, if you want to compete in my tournament this Saturday. Um, join the Alleycoin Discord, and that will give you instructions. We had one last weekend. It was really fun. Conquest, best of three, bring three decks, ban one. Uh, double Elim, 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time on Saturday. So that's probably around like 6 in the afternoon if you're European. Okay. Curious. Who knows what secret emotions you need to chill out? <laughs> We're just going to kill this guy. Now this is on the board, so if we pair it, damn, look at how chunky my parrots are. Just saying. I got legend with big mage, and it's only the second time I got it. Nice. Uh, this recent month, like today, or a previous? Hmm? Oh, May 31st on the last day, got you. And they're basically out of cards, right? I think we could just start laying these, laying these down. Ping, mistress. You know what? We'll ping. Because why not? Said so blizzards are the secret to beating the murlocs, and we currently have a lot of ways to generate more and more blizzards. Taunt was a kind of annoying, actually. Oh man, I mean, I could just throw down another parrot for the sake of like the board presence and ping and punch face and then Zol- or I don't guess I- oh, that feels bad if I have to trade what here, because I was going to say I could get another one. I want to be proactive. Hmm. I could trade this away, but I also kind of want to hold it just so if I want something to do. Hmm. I don't know if it was worth to like Always use so it to punch fun. face there. You know, because obviously I could have punched face for six if I had just used the blizzard. But I also kind of want to just like, how do they win if I just have endless blizzards? You know? I don't think the murlocs have a lot of burst, right? Like they don't play smite. I haven't tried the new Battlecry Hunter, but if you've got the list, I would be interested to try it out. The thing about streaming during the new stuff is like oftentimes if there's like really big decks popping up and things like that, you see it on Twitter or if you're watching other streams, but don't you dare lose this, lose to this. <laughs> I will not dare lose to this. <laughs> Yo, this is like Nemo cracked Nemo over here. Kind of scary. I could clear, but I think I'm just gonna go fix. I will consider trading this one. Probably should have traded first if that was gonna be my plan. Obviously. So we commit to our mistakes and we go face and we threaten. This world has enough heroes. But doesn't matter. Don't you door loose, Ali. I won't. Is this too slow? No. I'm quite upset about that paladin game. Could have gone rune. I suppose, but there's no guarantee that Rune even clears it. I mean, you have the blizzard, you get to play a little thing that gains you life. May the light <sighs> peace. It's fine. All right, so it's not Mech Paladin. So, oh yeah, Murloc Shaman's here, so we obviously have to play Murloc Shaman for him. The, uh, what's it called? Sorceress should get more value in this matchup here. 
I really want to test if Varden Magister Dawngrasp gets buffed from this thing, from the apparent bug. Whoa, calm down there. Crazy. Who here can spell Zinjari? Anybody? Shooting Star could pop the Divine Shields here, but I also think that Snap Freeze, like we could Blizzard something later in Snap Freeze and this might come in handy. I feel like that they said charge is ruining the fun. They printed a charge card like Mr. Smite. Yeah, I kind of... Ooh, this is a cool Liadrin portrait too. Dang. Who here can spell Zinjari? Anybody? Pick me! Pick me! Any questions? Okay. Uh, really, it's not too heavy. Definitely want to cast this next With turn. The step, the okay, there's guaranteed a spell in there. It's also Belinda, though. But I'm fairly confident I want to play this. I bring the muscle and the magic. Okay. It's my turn. So that's probably what the three mana kill a weapon or kill a minion's stats that it's one. This song is sad. A Leroy that gives other cards charge. This is very true. All right, are we ruining next turn? That is the question. Probably. However, this board is not that scary. Oh, that seems kind of scary. Costs one less for each paladin card you've played this game. Okay, I think we we doing it. Let's see what happens. Well, it'll clear the board. That's one thing it'll do. Okay, no draws, please. Ah, oh, I shouldn't have said it. Okay, it's fine. It worked. It was only one. No. Trust me. You can count on rune when it's targeting, like guaranteed targeting your min or the minions. Sorry, uh, the opponent then it's pretty reasonable. Okay. I think I'm gonna toss this. Ooh, what's in here, Rune? We wanna do this. Do you take me for an ordinary mage? Shit. Forgot about uh, hand space. Well, and I don't want to trade my thing because I'm obviously I'm gonna do that next turn. I don't want to cast snap freeze. Well, it's fine. If I burn amulet, I will be upset though. Yeah, that was a good uh, rune. You should try the naval mine rogue. Uh, went from plat eight to diamond five without losing a game. Is that the one that just killed like the death rattle four damage to everything? I hate that thing. I mean, I. Yeah, you could play it. Uh, I, I, I would believe that it is winning. I will say that. Especially, I played it in the beginning. Oh, I'm so mad. I'm so mad. <laughs> it's fine. Uh, it's okay. We have another one. Nobody, nobody stress. It's okay. I'm just only slightly pissed. It didn't have to happen. We still have another. It's fine. God damn. Do you want to get that out of the way? We have another amulet in there, and that's it. I think. Oh no, we have a blizzard in there as well. I could try and save it to like get both of them. Only so much time. Yeah, I was killing everyone from hand pretty much every game on turn six or seven. I believe you. Yeah, if you copy the thing, you have to copy the code, actually, liquid, lol. It doesn't, like, if you try to just 
copy paste it. It does all the actual cards. So, 13, 11. Man, I really need that amulet. I'm so sad that we burned that. Like, oh my god. Pick me! Pick me! Probably gonna Leviathan this. Yes, I could have brand snapped, dra snap freezed and killed that, but I'm gonna save my brand. Yeah, there's a part of me that just doesn't want to play it because it's so smorky, but I will, I will consider it. I mean, overall, the mage has been going pretty well for us. Like, I'm not freaking out about needing to win here. But if we wanted to try other decks, I suppose we could do it. Please do the Murlocs. All right, we'll do the Murlocs. But we must win this game first, though. Yo, where the hell? I need mutinous calicos, even sorceress, some another evoker. We need some like some proactive things to do here. I could cast rune and hope for the best, but if it winds up clearing a ton of my stuff, brand Zola. I kind of want to like brand parrot or something when I have something good in there. I mean, brand Zola, sure. I just get extra brands to my hand. Would I want a Zola anything else? Brand mutinous would be pretty dope. No, I, I know, I know. I'm just only so much time. trying to think if there's anything else I would want to use my Zola for. Sorry, I understand why you drew that conclusion the way I responded that way. No, I mean, it's something to do. They're probably just going to play Leviathan. What we really want to do is brand mutinous something. That sounds great. Do you like to play? The Brand Cloning Academy. Mm -hmm. Honestly, even if they do drop Leviathan or something, I kind of just want to cast the rune so I have something to do. Okay. Well, honestly, getting them to use a pyro, it's even, the, it's not an equality, but it's a Maki roll pyro play, like, sort of fine with it. There's the Dawn Grasp. Oh, it does! See, it does work, the bug. Hmm, fascinating. So we don't want to cast this, I think, until we have the amulet. But my god, there's just nothing to freaking do. All right, straight up, play a parrot. No, we can't play a parrot. YOLO rune? Yeah, do we want to do it with the parrot, though, or with the just the rune? Whatever. Shall Probably I just do? this rune. Oh my god, we're so going to burn cards. I'm going to be upset. It's fine. It's going to be the most proactive rune in the entire world. No drawing cards. That's great. No draw. Nice. Okay, we didn't draw! It's a miracle! Yeah, so there, the Snapdragon, it's the three mana uh, give minions in your deck plus one plus one. The bug right now is that it gives all battle cries in your deck plus one plus one. Plus one. So all are equal under the light. Your your hero, your battle cry heroes also get buffed. Oh my god. Let's fucking go. There's only three cards in the hand. Doesn't matter. We do it, right? Yeah, there's nothing else to do, right? <laughs> oh my god, it was huge! It was a huge smite! Now that's a mad paladin. That's crazy!